Praise Lord Church. Hallelujah. It's wonderful together in his presence on this beautiful Sunday morning. No matter where we have been this throughout this week, whatever difficulties we're going out. Hallelujah. This morning God gave us the privilege to come into his presence. And when we come into his presence, let's focus completely on him. Without any other thoughts, any other burdens, nothing that bothers us. Purely his attention, purely into his arms. Let's surrender. If that helps, if closing your eyes helps, do it. If clapping helps, do it. While you are worshiping, sing out loud. Praise Him. Hallelujah. So heavens can rejoice with us when we are worshiping Him. Hallelujah. That's the reason why we are here this morning. We all need Jesus every moment in our life and we have experienced that clearly. Every second in our life we need Jesus. 
There is no way out of it. There is no other master whom we serve. There is no other master who can guide us. So we need Jesus. Amen. All the children of God, give me an amen there. Hallelujah. Do we need Jesus? Do we need Jesus? Yes, we need Jesus. That is the reason why we are here. But I'm pretty sure the same thing has happened in each and every one of our lives. Where a moment. A brief second, a brief moment has come into your life where we find it very difficult to come in front of Jesus. That is the obstacle that Pastor is going to speak to us about. That is the obstacle. No matter what the obstacle is, you may feel like it's like the wall of Jericho. You're walking around it, around it, but the wall is not breaking. You're walking day one, day two, day three, still mentioning, still doing the harp. You're doing everything that the Lord has asked you to do. Still that wall is standing there. Don't be despair. Don't break your heart there. Know that the God who has appointed you in that moment, in that place, has a plan, has a great purpose for you. And He will break that wall. Hallelujah. He will break the wall that you are facing. That is the obstacle that we are going to face together. With God's grace and mercy, that wall has to fall. Amen. So let's continue to worship Him. Let's continue to worship Him. Oh, Jesus.
Let's just continue to worship. Let's just continue to worship God. Oh, hallelujah. in this major plan he planned for you to be right here in this moment in Sacramento in eternal life church of God this moment if you are standing here that God has a greater purpose God has a greater plan for you you are meant to hear the message that he is trying to tell you God is trying to talk to you and say That is the day that you will realize that my father is everything. 
Abba Father, I cannot do anything without you. Not a single moment in my life I can survive without you. Abba Father, am I worthy for it? No, my Lord. But your grace, your mercy has planted me where I am. And you have provided me everything. Every obstacle that I face, you made a way through it. Through the middle of it. Abba Father, thank you for your grace. Thank you for your mercy. Hallelujah. Lord, we have fallen short of your grace so many times. But yet you never forsake us. Yet you never left us. And again and again and again you called us back to you. Dear child of God. Dear son of God. Dear daughter of God. Dear my child, come back to me. Hallelujah. This morning, if anybody is burdened with the weakness, then how will I face my father? Know that he is ever loving and he is calling you back. He wants you back. Hallelujah. Jesus, sing that again.
what your plan is for tomorrow, Master. You know what your plan is, Master. And I completely trust in you. And I completely surrender into your hands. Whatever your plan for me tomorrow. Jesus. Jesus. I am an empty vessel in your hand. You may pour whatever you want. I am an instrument in your hand. You may play me as a whole. Father, we thank you, Master. We praise you, Master, this day. This is the day that you created for us, Lord, Master. Hallelujah. This is the day that you wanted us to come into your presence, Master, and you have allowed us to come, Master. We will continue to worship you, Lord. We pray that our praises and worship rise up to you and may it be pleasing to you, Master. Lord, clean our hearts, Lord, clean our soul. When we come into your presence, Master, may you be the only focus that we have. Bless the man of God who is going to speak the word, Lord. Help us to prepare our hearts so that your word may settle into us, Lord. And may it further and further grow and transform our life. May us be fruitful to you, Lord. Hallelujah. May our every action be fruitful to the kingdom of God. We thank you, Master. We worship you, Lord, for this day. In Jesus' mighty, precious name we pray. Amen. Amen. Amen.